What's up squad, welcome back to the channel. My name is Dylan, also known as Seek. You guys have been requesting this ever since the map came out and you're still requesting it to this day. So it is about time we finally do rush routes on Atlas Superstore. I hope you guys do enjoy the video. If you do, let me know by leaving a like on it. If you have missed any of the rush route videos we have done in the past for Modern Warfare maps, there's a playlist linked in the description to every rush route video I have done for search and destroy routes on Modern Warfare. Be sure to go check it out. If you are new to the channel, of course, be sure to subscribe and join the Seek Squad. And without further ado, let's hop right into it. All right, starting things off, we are on offense. And for class setups on this map, if you guys have seen my past rush up videos, you know, I typically run double time when I rush. On this map, with being so small, I actually run EOD, and I don't run a stun, I run a smoke, because a lot of the routes on this map involve you needing to block off a spawn snipe area so you can get through to the enemy spawn. So I run a smoke, I run EOD, and I also, one of the new things we are now running is the M19 pistol. If you go check out a video, I think it was made by Exclusive Ace, I believe, Exclusive Ace goes in, in this video and proves that the M19 is actually faster than a knife. You run faster with the M19 than you do with a knife. So on all my rush classes, I now run akimbo M19s because there's no reason not to. They move quicker, quicker than the knife. Alright everybody, first route is going to be my A route. I don't really play A offense very often, but when I do, this is how I play it. Throw the smoke right there. That way it smokes off that area. Cook the nade over the top. Then I run through. I usually hard aim and wait here for a minute. See if anyone pushes outside, I can pick anybody off here. And then I kind of just peek these corners back and forth to pick enemies off. Once I do that, then I typically end up planting the bomb. I don't usually rush all the way through when, I'm, when I go this set on A, just because there's oh, so many places to sit over here. It's better off to play A when you have the bomb, and then you can just get it down and just cover it and let them come to you. Because if you've played this map, you know there is about 50 different corners you can sit in in this area, and it's usually a death trap of 725s if you aren't careful. Now that is how I normally play A, but if I did want to push through on that A route, this is how I would do it. Make your way through, throw the smoke to block off that one area, hook the nade over the top, and then I go with smoke right through, immediately check the corner, and then I try to just work my way here, check up here, and pop up. And then I make my way through the spawn, just pit checking every little corner that anybody could possibly sit in and there is a lot of them so be very 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 careful when trying to make it through a here all right next route is my favorite route to run on this map this is my mid to a route gets you a lot of kills really quick here's what you're going to want to do throw the smoke hook the nade over the top immediately run through hard aim right here because somebody pushes up use this box to cover you from up top and you kind of just check your way through make sure no one's up there you can get up here then same thing, you can clear out this area, checking every little corner you could possibly find. Typically, I end up flanking to B from here, or I just finish them out through A if that's where they're sitting. All right, next up, my route. This is like B to, B to middle, more than anything, like middle flank. Gets you a good flank on B. Very similar to the last route. Throw the nade here, throw the stun. Immediately run your way through, going straight down, checking your areas. We always look right here right here and then I usually flank my way over to B because typically my team is going to go plant B so I just want to get that flank on and pick up people so they can get the bomb down safely and we can win the round. All right next shot is basically the same thing except this time instead of going through middle we're going to go to B. You want to walk your way through, cook the nade, throw the smoke, break all the way through, cut back immediately and get over to B. Our name this corner in case they rush it. And typically I kind of want to sit here and just sound horror because a lot of times they will rush up and you can pick them off here or they'll run around this corner you pick them off here. Once those guys push up or you know there's no one that's going to run up, you can kind of peek the corner. Be careful of this up top area. There's people up top that typically what I do is I just back off around and then I kind of try to work on that B flank so I can get behind them. If there's nobody up top, then I typically hug this corner and I wait because there's usually somebody right around this box. In which case I'll pick Pumman off the head glitch, and then right here, and then I can work my way through the spawn and flank A. Next up is my B route for offense. Here's what you're gonna do. Run right through the doorway, break your way back to the left. I typically like to throw the smoke here, and then throw the nade over the top. That should hopefully kill anybody who's pushing up on the box. Party in this corner. You wanna know how to play it? Careful that there is snipers. You kind of want to use this box to kind of cover you. 
then I come here, I'll peek it. If there's a sniper, then I just back my way off and I just kind of work on just covering up the areas I know enemies like to sit. And then inevitably I get the bomb down. Typically, if you're careful, you can jump right behind the bomb. I kind of screwed up there, but if you're careful enough, you can just hop right behind the bomb really quick without getting sniped. Plant the bomb and then jump out of the way of the sniper and just let me him have to push up to you instead of uh, getting pushing up to him and most likely dying because that, that room is a very good position to have a sniper. All right, next up is my B route. Here's what you're gonna wanna do. Typically, I go to B if I wanna plant the bomb. I get the nade, I cook it over on middle. Gonna run right through here, get ready to throw the smoke. Gonna throw the smoke right over the top. Get that smoke down, that way it covers up B. Hard aim for anybody pushing. You should have stayed behind this box as well in case snipers have thermal. You can work your way through, check right here. Check there, and then most importantly, Check up top. If you see a sniper up top, then you want to be very careful when you go to play the bomb here. Typically, you want to jump, lay down. You can typically pull that off before they get you. Then you can hop back around the corner and force them to push you. You can pick them off as they come, and the bomb is down. And it's typically a very easy win pushing B and planting it on this map. All right, for my last route on offense, you're going to want to stun. It's another B route, but this is the B route you're wondering you don't have the bomb. This is the route you do when you're just trying to rush and flank A through B. Get that pistol swap out. Make sure you have a stun for this version. You're going to run right through here. Don't throw the nade up top there. You're going to use it in a different scenario. Hit this corner. Throw the nade as far as you can. Throw the stun just a little far in case anybody pushes up. If you stun anybody, you can simply kick them off right here. And then you work your way through. Be careful if there is a sniper. You're going to want to back off. But if there isn't, you can work your way through right here. Check the head glitch. Check the corner to hopefully nade it somebody. But if not, and you hit mark them, you can get them there. You can work your way through on the A flank and getting quite a few kills as you go. All right, switching things over to offense. Let's start out with A, back to a smoke as well. Make your way through the doors. Get that smoke right there. Hook that nade over the top and then quickly run through before the smoke disappears so you don't get sniped. Hit this corner. Check it. Check there. And then check here. You can also then slide through, putting it in this corner and anybody up top. I'll hop up top and then I'll work my way through. I want to check this area, check right here, and you can usually typically flank B or A depending on where you believe the enemies are the most. Next up is my mid A route. This route is kind of risky, but if you pull it off correctly, it can get a lot of kills, especially if the especially if they are pushing A quite a bit. You gotta be very careful that you gotta get it correctly. I'm gonna run right through here, throw the nade to the right there, throw the smoke right on the top of the wood. Once that smoke goes down. You can slide your way through right here and stay behind the smoke. Hard aim here and here. Check for any enemies. Check the corner quickly and then get out of the way before that smoke disappears. That way you can hop up here and pick anybody off that is up top. And then essentially clear out the same area you did for the A route. You just go about it in a different way. All right, this next route is probably my favorite run to run on defense. This is my mid to B route. Here's what you're going to want to do. Break your way through the doors. Go to the right side, you want to cook the nade over the top of the shelves, same with the smoke. Once those go down, you can run all the way through. Check right here real quick, you can just pick somebody off. If not, run your way through. Hard aim right here. Check for people to push up. Sound horn, a lot of people like to lay down over here, so be very careful. I usually check there, and then I'll slide past to see if anybody's there. Typically, they'll see me there, then they'll run around, so you just hard aim this. They'll come push you, you pick them off, and you work your way through to the spot. Okay, next up for defense is, is essentially the same route, except this time instead of going to B, we're going to go to A. We're going to push right through, throw the exact same smoke and nade. This typically they'll end up with the kill. Exact same smoke and nade over the top. This time, you're going to work your way through, checking for anybody rushing up right here. And then you hard aim right here because people like to push and pick them off there. You check up top and you can kind of just work your way through and essentially do the same thing we did for the A routes. Clear up top and work your way through to the spawn. All right, finishing off defense, we are doing a B route. Make your way through to the right and run straight through to B. Get ready with a nade in just a moment. You're gonna wanna throw the smoke right there. Throw the nade right there so it goes over the top of the boxes. Gets people to hit that corner. You can hard aim, get ready to fire anybody that wants to run through. And typically you already have B control, be careful of the window, but you can make your way through to the spawn and flank all the enemies that went A. 
All right, squad, that is it for Rush Routes on Atlas Superstore. Hope you guys found it helpful. I'm going to go ahead and leave you guys with clips of me using these routes in an actual game. So I hope you guys did enjoy. If you do, let me know by leaving a like. Of course, if you are new to the channel, be sure to subscribe and join the Seek Squad. Without further ado, though, enjoy the clips. Search and destroy. Uh, Protect uh, the assets. Uh, uh. Watch your backs. We're on our own out here. <laughs> Yeah, red dot is kind of better. Just can see people now. Same route. Let's just do it successfully this time. Locations confirmed. Defending them is critical. Probably gonna expect the double nade here again. Just this time. Yeah, there's that guy, but I want this guy. He's in more of a power position. Now we can come back and kill this guy, because he'll double back for me. Yup, he just got really quick, and I thought he was going to, though. Yeah. He may should have him. But... We've taken the advantage. Make sure we keep it. Target. But, like, I've got good routes on it. I just, I'm not consistent with him. We have the bomb. Not really sure why, but... Just one of those maps. Friendly UAV online. That route's really good. That's it, comrades. On to the next the target. That's fine. Friendly UAV online. Bomb secured. <laughs> UAV ready for deployment. 